Super R3M 2020 is a really nice 56mm cube and it is a magnetic cube. It has really nice shades and really really vibrant, more way more vibrant than the previous RS3M, which is the RS3M 2020, which is not really the previous one, but yeah, same thing. It is a little bit larger as well than the previous RS3M. This one is 56 and this one is 55.5 millimeters. Out of the box, the cube is really tight, but uh, yeah, it is also really dry as well and really fast. The corner cut itself goes up to 45 degrees, but it takes a little bit more effort after it. Uh, reverse corner cutting, you can do it in an average level, but then it takes even more effort to do it uh, around is it 33 degrees. Comparing to the RS3M, you can definitely see that this cube it has a way more higher quality than the previous cube. And also it, is, it feels really rich as well. This one feels like a proper budget cube, which is um, quite, oh, it's still okay. I still can accept it, but it's just not really that good anymore. The cube comes in nine pounds, 99 pence in Cubes UK. And it is really cheap for that price, considering it being very high quality as well. So the reason I have this Super RS3M is because my friend told me to set it up for him. So we're just gonna do it now. So quickly, after looping the cube, we can see that the corner cut is way better, and also the reverse corner cut as well. Well, not maybe that much, but yeah, you can get what I mean. So I put some Lubus Pro in the tracks and also the pieces, which probably a bit too much Lubus Pro, and no DNM. Let's get to the performance. So after looping the cube, the cube definitely has gone faster and also way smoother. Um, yeah, I've been getting really good times with the cube. I've been getting a very good average actually, um, about 13 to 14 second average, which is pretty nice. My PB is like 13 seconds or something. But yeah, I really recommend this cube. But yeah, uh, I'll see you in the next video. I'll be having a lot of upcoming videos soon, so I'll see you later.